Greetings and welcome to NIMBY. In the previous episode, we set up the southwest and the southeast routes down here under Nightington and Aylston and Oddby. Um, they are going quite well. We also bought additional trains for the north route in hopes that they would stop some of the uh, some of the compensation problems. So we'll have to keep an eye on those. We're looking over here for any pop-ups saying um, waited too long. Now there were compensations going on for the day, but they were they were building up quite badly, and the problem occurs here. And we can see, oh, actually, they're already starting to uh, to battle up now. We've got 219 people already in here. Where are you all headed? Give me the number one people. Uh, so there's a bunch of people going to different places, actually. Um, so the Cedar Academy is up here. Okay, it's good. That's there. And then Red Round Hill is there. Also the Red Route. And Windf Windfield Park is there. And okay, so the Red Route is basically just b busy. Uh, okay, it is just busy. What is the Red Route's uh, time between stops, though? Um, let's see. Oop, wrong one. We are eight minutes between stops. If we need more trains, it's going to make this into a really, really high speed line because there'll be like a train every minute and a half or something like that. <clears throat> anyway, let's keep this view on compensations just so we can see which lines do start popping up any kind of compensation issues. Um, I also wish there was a way to get this to disappear. This piece of, of junk over here. I wish there was a way to get this to disappear uh, when you were not wanting to see one of them. Like, like, de I want to deselect it. I want to deselect it. Let me deselect it. No. Because um, it takes up a big chunk of the screen and I don't want to have to turn that off. Just I want to keep this piece down here. So um, it would be amazing if you'd uh, have the ability to like, click a button here and just minimize that back. That'd be, that'd be awesome. It'd be good. All right. Well, we'll give an eye on that one for now. Uh, our job today, on the other hand, is actually to start building on the west side of uh, Leicester. Now, I don't know if we're going to go out this far. Let's have a look at the density maps out this way. Uh, density map. Uh, it would be worth touching those areas across the river. And the motorway would, would be worth doing them. They are busy. Down here and the blood, I believe, I'm going to count these as separate areas. They're, they're high density, don't get me wrong. And I might in the future do a little loop around these that connects to the two routes here. But for now, I'm going to just play with the idea that these are, uh, they are different areas to this, this part. Okay. Uh, okay. Let's give the turn off for now. We don't really need that while well, we're going to be building some tracks. Let's get some track building. New stations. Now, I want this this south station, the the west route, to connect to to Alston Hall Garden Station, and also to Leicester Cent Leicester Clock Tower. So th these two points, and I want the north the northwest to connect to School Lane, and also to Mahatma Gandhi st Station, and then also to at least one point on the uh, the other line going across. <clears throat> I want to have at least. I want to be connected to multiple other lines if possible. All right, let's get the uh, the thing in place. So we're going to start connecting you here. So we want a train station that will um, tram, tram. You have the tram, right? Yes, tram. Right, tram line goes to there. I say that because this looks like a train station to me. It's, it's big, definitely bigger than this one. What are you? You are. I can't see what you are. I can't edit you, so I'm going to assume you have a train station because you're bigger. Probably just made a mis I made a mistake or something early on. Either way, new station. That's that one done there, and then your next station from there will be up at Leicester Clock Tower. There. Boop. And the move tool just extend it so the match. There we go. All right, that's the two intersect stations in place. And there'll be a strip, strip line. There'll be uh, a station over here somewhere that they'll connect to. So they'll go up, out, and back in again. So that will be somewhere around here. We do it in Bede, Bede Island just to uh, for the fun of it. But uh, I feel we should do it to this side just for maximum coverage. There we go. Yep, that'll cover that. We need to, this is a, this area is going to be requiring to hop the uh, the line a bit. Anyway, once you've been to Leicester. Uh, station you're going to come out this way and then you're going to run across this way so we'll take you straight out there and you think you are for a newfound pool I can't see how big that station is so let's make it to 100 meters and then you're pretty much going to run out there to, and then down this road here so if we were to come down this side just make sure we get it all covered uh, you come to there and that, one's, that dual station is here so we can have that one go there and then come to here before heading down 
like that, which means we can go to the move tool and pull you in this way just to aid like that in the connection to this station, which will then aid in the connection to that station. There we go. And that will then link those up. Then when you're here, you'll shoot out this way and you'll come across to this part and you'll start heading up north here. So cut you out to traffic density, please. I really, really could do a traffic density map at this point. Shoot across here. To 100 meters, boom. And we don't want to cross the motorway. We'll go, if we gap something on the way, that's, that's great, but we don't want to be going purposely across the motorway if we can help it. Uh, these areas, I, I feel they're just outside of our current remit for our current mission. Uh, so we're going to get you up to here. And we are losing a bit of space over the road, so I'm going to pull this across this way and try and get as much this side as we can. There we go. Uh, we could probably pull that one across here then a bit more and just help out and grab some of that uh, little bit of here if we can. There we go. We can pull a lot more actually. It's going to have some curves on it, but it covers more land, right? Uh, our goal is to catch this one, which is going to cut across there and down. Now, this part here is the problem. So, I don't want to go across here. The curvy part, I feel that should be part of the northwest loop. Um, so, I'm going to cut you down here then. That will actually really help us out with this piece. Cut you down there. And then bring you over to here. Oh, now, we get to here. Oh, it actually cuts with a lot of the area nicely. Now, if we just move that station, however, um, north to here. Maybe we bring you south a bit, uh, say there. We could put another station in over by Fort Atlesley that would do the job. And then we just need to move that over so they line up better. I'm going to move you that way, it would even line up even better. There we go. That that actually gives us the most coverage. People can, they can walk if you're here, right? <laughs> Alright, that will cover us with that. So let's get the tracks in place so we don't forget about them. Uh, you would run over to here, which you can't do because of the river in the way. Um, so we'll bring you straight to there, and then to there. Then we'll switch to viaduct mode to get across that. Then back to tram as fast as possible. And apparently there's another little river there, we'll go to train tracks. Back to tram, because train tracks can jump a little, little river, no problem. You then come up here, your job is to get to that one. So you're going to go that way. And up to here. Ooh, where are you? Where's the where's the where's the river? It's the teeny tiny river right there. Okay. Good to know it's there. We'll just switch to a train track to get across that. There we go. And where? Where? Really? You be complaining about that? Okay. Okay. Okay game. Uh you need to get uh, train, train track, I could, I could, I could put a train track here, but you can't get across that, can you? There we go. Uh, boom, switch back to uh, tram line, and then connect you to that, which says it can't do because there's a waterway there. Okay, not a problem. Uh, cancel that, go this way, and you just do train track over that, then back to tram, and then tram to there. Oh god no, because that's that's horrible. Stop it. Stop it. Tram line there to there. Uh, that is that's just horrible. Why is there no bend on that track? Seriously. Can we can we make sure the track actually curves? It doesn't look at that. God that's horrible. Okay, send you out this way. And then to there, okay. It's, it's not, I mean, we could have gone straight, but I prefer to have a little bit of a bend on the track, to tell you the truth. Uh, you can make it over to here, and there's nothing stopping you, so we can do that to there, to there. There you go, so that one's pretty straight, sadly, but not much we can do about that. You're going to go to there, which means you're going to cross this river. And then bring you to there, boom. So the curve, that curve adds a bit of bit of texture to the game, doesn't it? And you need to run up to that one, and you get stopped there due to Edy Biddy River. But we can go around that. This one then comes across here. Now this is where we need to switch to a viaduct, because we have to get across this uh, big body of water. Back down to trams again, and then to there, and then you should be able to shoot out this way to that one, down to that one, and into that one. That will... Interestingly, let me try that, but no. 
and bring you down this way and you're gonna have to do a viaduct jump here as well and then tram line to there viaduct again tram trap 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 tra tra tram there okay and then you can run down here and hopefully you don't have any problems connecting to anybody up here so we'll just boop to boop and then you're gonna come down and you have gonna to have to cut across uh, at least what four rivers there so I'll bring you this way train and track you across that one uh, to there then we'll have to can we get a train track across that no ride up to across that one and then into there boom there we go and that maintains the 45 all the way that is all up and running that is pretty good coverage 22 million on that one and then we're going to build the north route um you know what let's just pop that one down now anyway boom there we go uh, and then next up on the list, um, they were going slower than I thought they were going. Uh, then on the next one, we're going to be doing new stations again. And the first one's going to be at, I do want to connect to Mahatma Station here. And I want to connect to maybe the car, maybe really far up there. Uh, help, it, help people jump the stations a bit. And I want to join one over here. So we'll start you joining one over here first. Uh, so oops, that should be stations, not tracks there put that one there move it so it matches the distance perfect uh, then the next one will be the Mahatma station right there again move to a line and then they will need one up here I think we go for the top station because it might help cut off some of the uh, travel the red line that people are doing right now uh, put that to there there we go okay that's the intersect stations all in place now we're just going to put the actual proper stations to cover this area so we'll start with you since you're actually the uh, the easy one to work with i think come off that station there you come up to kirby firth area station goes right there then we go from there uh, we're going to get a station somewhere around here so i can get most of that area now uh oh we can actually no actually cancel that station we can send you because you're going to go that way and back up from here. So we send you wide. You're going to go to Glenfield. Then you're going to go. Then we have the other station going the other side, which will be here, going into there and up here. That will come up here. There. That one will come across. And it's heading over to the Mahatma. So you're going to do there. You're going to go here, and then you'll have a line here. 100 meters please there we go that takes you to the Mahatma then the Mahatma comes out of there and comes up here all right okay so this is where we get into the making sure we get closer to so you're there you come to here and have a line right there and your job is good to that station curves back around comes back down and cuts through here because it can more than anything else that one goes down to here now we've got this big busy area here, so I think we'll try and drop into here if we can. We have to look into that gap. That, that's a very dense area, and I'd like to have a station covering it if we, if we can. That one goes there. Okay, that covers all those areas. This area here I want to cover better if we can. So I think we can start by pulling this station south a bit. There we go. That Yeah, that's, that's fine there. Uh, I think you can pull more this way. That's actually near perfect, covers most of it like that. Um, like there, and if we bring you more this way, can't do much else than that, really. There we go, and there's this bit, bit bottom here, we can probably squeeze a bit more of that in. That's a really difficult one to get at, though. Uh, I think we can pull you more that way, but I don't want to, I can't go too far because we are just starting to expose other areas in the process. I think that's about the best we can do. All right, let's put some new tracks down and get this thing all lined up. So start here at the Mahatma Gandhi station going northbound. And your job is to get to that station there. Okay, so you're going to be a hard turn out the station, up to this river, viaduct over the river, 
right, right, right up to the river and then back to tram lines. So be careful with that little bit of water that's there, but that gets you to there. You can then go north to this station. You then go north to, oh, you're going over here now. So you have a nice little run over here. So boop, boop, bear doop. And then you do a hard turn. You have to obviously get over here. And I don't want you to do a too hard a turn like that. So I will put you there. You then come down to this one. Boop. You come down to Brunswell, Brunswell Lodge. Brunswell Lodge comes down across to County Hall, Leicestershire County Council. All right, nobody wants to go there, but if you have to go there, you have to go there. It's the uh, council office, and nobody ever really wants to go to a council office, do they? Uh, Elder Pack then shoots down to here. And then you have to try and find your way over this way. Boop, boop. Bird doop. And then you, you find your way up to the new College of Leicester when there's a river here going to cause us a little bit of hassle. So we can just skirt around that river like that. Cut across to Gorse Hall City Farm. Uh, who wouldn't want to go to Gorse Farm, right? Then straight to Pets Corner after you've been to the farm. Yes. And then to Mahatma Station. Boom. And we have the loop. It's a big loop compared to the south one, though, unfortunately. But uh, hey, it is what it is, right? Build it. Build it. All right. Now we're going to do the bit that we have to do and we have a pause on, unfortunately. So we'll put that back up there so we can see how bad we're doing. Pause it. And get the lines built. So new line, and the new line will be called Leicester. Oh God, no, Leicester West. Uh, this will get the name Leicester copied into the clipboard, so I don't keep typing it. Leicester W. Price will be two dollars per ticket, and let's get some stations in there. Right, so the West one's this one here, and it will start here. So on the Alpha route. Alpha, 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 Charlie, Alpha, 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 Do we have a station here? Let's go swore we put a station in here. And that's supposed to be the catching point. Uh, very quickly to tracks, um, move tool, that one, delete, yep, and that one, delete, yep, and then new station goes in there, because it's not a dual station here, and it's not a dual station there, so that would have to be the dual station then. Yeah, somehow it got missed out. Hmm, interestingly weird. Uh, connect you to that one. And connect you to that one. Build them. There we go. Back to the line and finish building that line. The west line. Um, we're going to go for alpha. Uh, keep going around the tracks here. Uh, alpha. Alpha. Then back on itself, bravo. Do this out a little bit, it's easy when you go faster. Bravo. Down, 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 down. Elmerville College, brown. Bravo on you. Bravo on the post office. Bravo on the community primary school. Bravo on Fort Pasley. Delta on the Memorial Christian School. Bravo on Richard Gardens. Bravo on Newfound Pool. And we're done. Okay. Uh, that's all that's set up, so remove that from that tag and get some trains on here. How far is it? 50 kilometers. And based on other 50 kilometer stations, you. Uh, Leicester Southwest. Leicester Southwest is running six trains, so we want six trains. So, first thing, clone one train, not clone the schedule, purchase. You are going to go into the west line. And then we need to clone you five times. 
There we go, they're all set and they can start running straight away. But before we do that, we want to get the other line running, which is the northwest. So lines, uh, new line, Leicester, northwest. And the code is Leicester northwest. And it's still going to be two per thing. And then we add the tracks. There we go. All right, and we'll start you at the Mahatma station since we're we building Alpha Mahatma, Mahatma, uh, Alpha at Woolsey, Alpha at Morance, Alpha at the Cedars, Alpha at the Hatlams. I'm trying to say the names quickly. Alpha at Castle Hill, Alpha at Buswell, Alpha at the Community Hall. Alpha at Ellis Park, Alpha at Highway Spinning, Alpha at ML Christian School, Emmanuel, sorry, Alpha at New College, Alpha at Goss City Hall, Alpha at Pets Corner, Bravo at Mahatma, Bravo at Pets Corner, Bravo at Goss Hill, Alpha at New College, Bravo at Emmanuel, Bravo at Highway, Bravo at Ellis, Bravo at County Hall, Bravo at Bunswell, Bravo at City Hall, Bravo at Hallam, Bravo at Cedars, Bravo at Morris, Oswaven, Bravo at Woolsey, and then we're back to the ground. There we go. Perfect. All right, so Mahatma Gandhi Station gets a lockdown on the zero there, and also. Sorry for a second, where are you? There. They're locked, and then the other one, the. The, 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 the west, just straight west, this one. Uh, it would lock up at. Straight West is this one. Straight West would lock up at Clock Tower. Boom. And Clock Tower. There you go. So they are both locked. Okay. And we need to put new trains. How big is the Northwest one? Northwest one is 84 kilometers. Ugh. It's a big line. We have another 84 kilometers and it causes no end of problems. All right. How many trains do you have, my friend, in the North? 11 trains. I don't want to buy 11 trains. So I'm going to say we'll do a new train. Uh, click anywhere to add a new schedule slot. No, nope, not a new schedule slot, a new train. Add a train. Maximum size, just the one. Purchase. It will go into the northwest. That's the northwest. We'll clone it. We got one already, so we'll put down <coughs> nine trains. It's going to cost us a crap ton of money. It's all of our money for a while. So, so let's go with eight trains. They're all on that list there, we're good. And we can go back here and just get them running. So we're gonna to say to you a two minute delay on all of, oh, nope, not on you, I got off. And southeast, where's the west? Northwest, two minute on you. And west, two minute on you. Let the train spread out a little bit and then we'll, uh, <clears throat> once the trains are spread out just a tiny little bit, we can get them moving. Do 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 45s and uh, you've got an 11 minute gap so I'm gonna put you to a straight 11 minute gap boom and hopefully we'll start seeing these trams level themselves out pretty quickly after that let's switch you to that one so we can see the other lines a little bit better and see how the trains level themselves out <clears throat> sadly doing them at this time of day was actually a bad idea because they are uh, they are now very much um, bottlenecking up at the stations 
and the passengers at this of the stations are going to start complaining pretty quickly. Um, compensation, Central, East, South. To be fair, the West aren't complaining just yet, so maybe we get away with it. Maybe, just maybe. Uh, let's pick Peter Central as our selected station so we can see this lot a little bit easier. There we go. <clears throat> trains are moving around. They're going to hopefully get to a point where these ones over. Oh, let me curse on. There it is. These ones over here at Ansley on the top, uh, the northwest track will space themselves out pretty soon, hopefully. And um, they're getting there. There's just two trains that are still a little bit close by the look of that. It looks like the south. Yeah, the west station's open and up running fully. The other one does be. Yeah, they appear all now to be relatively spaced out. I don't see any problems currently going on. Okay, that I'm happy with. Uh, any problems on the compensation side? Just on south, Lincolnshire East, Central and North is still getting a lot of people complaining about it. I can't do much about that, sadly. <coughs> um, so hopefully we can run this track a little bit and bring ourselves some cash in because we have spent a lot of cash recently. Um, I would love to put another train on the Northwest, uh, Northwest. Luckily, nothing's happening yet, but it is middle of the night. I'd love to put some more trains on there, but I don't feel they're going to uh, work out well. I may need to just fast forward it to build up some cash reserves, and it wouldn't take too long for me to do that off camera. Just hit maximum speed, let the money ramp up to a hundred million or something like that, and then we can start building our uh, interlink. And that's going to cost us quite a bit because it's going to be high speed train track across there. And then we have to build high-speed trains. I'm going to need 100, 200 million easy for that uh, that build. So that's going to be a pricey one. So I will probably just have to fast forward that until we make that money. And if we, to be fair, our expenditure, let's have a look. Expenditure, <coughs> construction, train, maintenance. Running costs for yesterday. Where's my day? There we go. Running costs. 200,000 in running costs, 11,000 in maintenance, 8 million in uh, fee, fees, in fares. If you take off even, if we take a whole million off of that, it's still seven million in fares. That's still making money. So we're just going to put out for the loan payments that do come off uh, in the early month. What day they come off actually? When do we pay our loans back? Uh, this is the loan we have here. We uh, payments were there at sixty. They are paid on the eighteenth of March. So we got loads of time left to make it, and even then, our payment will be eighteen million. We got enough in the bank to cover cover that right now we're just gonna make sure we keep that amount of money in the bank to cover it so looking at all this these lines though so far none of the west have, have compensations which i'm happy about um refunds on the wests northwest has that six grand of refunds because they're too high but they can go and screw themselves on that because they, they won't travel far they can travel far that's basically somebody who was uh, a belgrave wanting to go to glenfield who took the northern route and the pain per kilometer. That's all that really is. Um, yeah, because if we put on a, a entry fee, somebody going from Belgrave to Grinfield will be very happy, but somebody going from Belgrave to Wolsey will be really complaining about it. So we uh, we keep on what we have, and we've got this nice little network. I feel this should have been two tracks. It should definitely cut up here, and then add two loops there, like a north, west, and a um, and the west and like a southwest, but this is already southwest, so I feel this one needs cutting into two, and maybe the same with this one as well. Um, that would actually help with the compensation problems, I believe. If we, do, if we were to run a stunt line across there and split this into two and this into two, that might help in the long run. Just going to keep an eye on that, that's all. All right, well, I'm going to run this for a little bit, just for a few seconds. Let's just do it now. There we go. And we're going to see by the end of the day. Um, do those lines cause us any problems with uh, the compensation stuff? They probably will do, uh, but as long as that money is going up, that's all I care about right now. And we'll uh, we'll pause it at twenty three hundred hours and see what we get on the whole, you know, compensation on especially on the new line, especially on that northwest line, because I'm worried about the northwest line giving us a bit of a problem with compensations because it's the same as the north; it's big and it's a busy area. May need to break those two into smaller zones. All right, stop the timer. There we go, and let's take a look. Uh, the north is with uh, no, we, we in compensation, please. Central is a... really central has nineteen thousand in compensations, and really, 
5 million in fares instead of 11 million. Oh, it's a weekend, it's Saturday, okay. Oh, so it's like the fares, the things are really low. Uh, well, Central got through, North got through, the West didn't get any compensation. So, generally, we did good, although it is a weekend, so that's not uh, that helpful overall. Um, so, we'll have to just wait that one out until the next time <clears throat> when we, uh, we see if that all works out for us. Uh, we are now in Sunday, so we're going to have to wait until Monday to see if it all works or if it fails or anything else. That, however, we will find out now. Because if I'm going to run this uh, very, very fast over the between the episodes so you can get some money in the bank to build stuff, we kind of got to see if we can do some work before then, don't we? Alrighty, I'll be back in just one moment as soon as we hit Monday at, uh, at 2300 hours. Alrighty. We are now here at Monday at 23.46. Let's see what our things have to say. Uh, let's see. Saturday, Sunday, we end up paying a 200k in compensations. On Monday, on the round, which is today, 800,000 in compensations. Ouch. All right, they need to be sorted out. Let's have a look at the uh, the things here. Leicester Central was a biggie on, uh, on the Sunday. Uh, Leicester, no, Saturday, on today. So, so let's see. The uh, surprisingly, none of the West got a voting competition. This line may need less trains, maybe. All right, East with fifty-one thousand compensations. Not too worried about that. The North and the Central, those ones are to worry about. The North, wait too long, eleven thousand. Can't do what about that. That needs to be split into smaller runs. And I think what we need to do is pull some trains from over here because uh, this is not getting compensation issues. So I don't think there's a problem with it. Uh, however, the central is getting really, really busy now because there's all these places linking to it. It's getting so busy. 400,000, 18,000 complaints about waiting too long. Ugh. Okay. The only way around here is to literally have more trains because that's what the problem here is. It's, I think it only has like four trains, doesn't it? Um, central has five trains. I think we uh, seriously need to increase the number of trains on that line. Let's see, we clone that. Um, there's five trains on there now. If we put four more trains on that line. There we go. Uh, not enough money to buy four trains. Ooh. Uh, 35,000? Yeah. Buy, buy three new trains on that line. Uh, apparently I didn't have the clone the thing set up. So, oops, God, no. Cancel, 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 cancel. These trains need to go on to Leicester Central and be added into the mix. And we have to alter the schedule really quickly on Leicester Central. Uh, stops, expand. If we're using the trams, we have a 45 limit. If we're using the trams, we have a 45 speed limit, because that's how fast the trams can go. Uh, the trams can do 70, but the track can only handle 45. Now, it is possible in, in the future we might just have to start putting down train tracks instead of tram tracks. The downside to train tracks is they can't navigate the streets very well. They get all these little streets cause hassles, so hmm, they, cause, they cause us some problems over the long run. Anyway, they say it's an 11 minute gap, <clears throat> um, down to 70, 7 minutes 33. Let's make that a 7 minute gap. There we go. Set the interval, lock it in. They should lock it everywhere apart from the car stations, which there aren't apparently any car stations, so I have no problem with that. Uh, let them run, and hopefully that clears up that problem. But we'll find out if it does in the next episode when these uh, additional trains complete their circuits. But yes, uh, well, for now I'm not going to buy anything else. And I will be running this up until we reach about 200 million in the bank. And then next episode we'll have 200 million in the bank and we'll start working on this interlink here and any problems that occur during that run. So <clears throat> until next time, comments in the comments. Thanks for watching and I will see you next time. Bye.